God, I think I'm having a rap attack. In control. In control. In control. Golden Era Radio. For those of you who don't know, Eric B is President is a song that I made 25 years ago in my living room on a four track. Eric B used to be my roommate and used to see a lot of artists come through the studio and become stars. So when Eric B was scheduled to bring in his first rapper, guess what? His first rapper never showed up. Somebody told me that it was Freddie Fox that was supposed to show up. But the next day, a rapper did show up. And that rapper that showed up, his name was Rakim. With a real, real smooth flow, we didn't know what was about to happen to the rap industry at that point. Now, when Rakim first came to the studio, we made a song called My Melody First. Turn up the bass, check out my melody, hand out a cigar. I'm letting knowledge be born, and my name's the R. AKA, I am not like the rest of them, I'm not on the list. It was real slow, down tempo, the energy really wasn't there, and me and Eric had an idea to come with next. He said, let's use the bass line from Fonda Ray's Over Like a Fat Rat. Now this record right here was a hot joint in the club. It always worked when you threw it on, the crowd would always go crazy. And I suggested that we use Funky President beat because I already knew that James Brown was always a hit when you sampled it or played it in hip hop parties. Using that Fonda Ray bass line and putting it with Funky President was impossible because the tempos did not match up. Well, to combat that problem, I need to pull out my CZ-101 so I can replay it. It was a little small keyboard made by Casio, which had great sounds. I already knew that it would work because I just used it the day before when I made my melody. So today, we're going to recreate that bass line with the new Akai MPC Renaissance. I loaded a very similar sound, like that bass sound. As you can see, it spread out from pad 5 to pad 12 in different keys. And since I'm not a keyboard player, we're going to recreate that bass line today with one finger. So what I really had to do was to recreate the beat from Funky President. I got my favorite kick and snare, which was Impeach the President. So this is the way the kick and the snare sounds when I put it inside the Akai. I put it in four parts because we have the kick and the snare, and I have two in-between ghost notes. We'll teach you about that in a minute. What I wanted to do was recreate that pattern from Funky President, which went mm, mm, eh, mm, 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 eh, mm, mm, eh. So what I would do is after I reprogrammed it, it came out like this. Real stiff, sounds kind of hot, but not quite there because the ghost notes are missing. I was taught about the ghost note from Mr. Clyde Stubblefield, James Brown's original drummer. He told me in between each kick and the snare, there's something flying in between, which he described as the ghost notes. The ghost notes for Eric Beer's president would be these. Now, it doesn't seem like it means much, but when you add it with the beat, it creates such an illusion of a complete loop. Watch my hands closely. Did you see that? That was the ghostly sound in between the kick and the snare. Watch it again, I'm gonna do it slowly for you. Basically, ghost notes could be anything. Today's ghost note is actually the reverb or a hi-hat sound that's resonating from the kick in the snare that I put in between to basically fill in the loop. Thank you, Mr. Clive Stubblefield, for that bit of information so I could share it to the public. And of course, this song would not be complete without that drum roll from Funky President, in which I put on two pads to control the tempo. At any tempo, I could use that drum roll. And you already know that I recreated Funky President Beat. Name, 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 
But it's kind of nasty. I can't even front. And of course, there was a lot of scratch elements in this song. Eric B. cut in The Champ by Mohawks. Champ! And the ever so popular Get Up, Get Into It, and Get Involved by James Brown. Everybody over there! Get on up! Everybody right there! Get into it! Everybody right there! Get involved! Everybody you! Yeah. Well, at the start of Eric B. as president, we hear the song Long Red by Mountain. Well, since we have everything else loaded into the NPC, we put Rakim's vocals in. percent of the song was mixed and produced by me, yours truly, Marley Maul. I didn't get credit for producing it, but that's a gift that I just gave to Eric B to get his career moving. Well, today's lesson is simple. I'm a quarter from Rakim. He said it best. It ain't where you're from, it's where you're at. Now think about it. We're sitting back in a day with a little bit of sampling time, four tracks in a living room. Since there was limited to four tracks, we had to put the hottest things on those four tracks. I say this to say that limitations made us what we were. We were making classic hip hop and the projects in the living room. No studio and four track. So it's not where you're from, it's where you're at. Sometimes limitations are good. I know what you're all sitting there waiting for. Is he gonna do it this time? Yes I am. It's time for that special spice. <laughs> Today's special spice is the hi-hats and the 808 that sit under the track. This right here. You really didn't hear that in the track because it's something that we hide. As I played it separately, we noticed a slight echo on the hi-hats. Listen. That was so important to the record. The 808 is helping the kick of Impeach the President because Impeach the President was a live kick snare. It really didn't kick that hard, but it had a nice top tone to it. So what I would do, I would add this under it to resonate under the kick, to give it that resonation that the speakers love to smile to. You can hear it like this when it's all together. You didn't know about that. Something hidden in the track that made your head bop. Now, that's how that classic recipe was made. We had Rock Him on the mic, Eric B on the cuts, a soulful disco break, and a nice James Brown loop, all put together by yours truly, Marley Marl. That's how classics are made. Thanks for tuning in to this edition of Classic Recipes with your boy, DJ Legend, AKA Marley Marl, here at Dubspot. Keep tuned in because we got a lot more classic recipes coming. Thank you for tuning in. I love you. Peace till next time. It's your boy. It's your boy. You don't recognize? CZ 101. A cheesy one. <laughs> Welcome to another edition of <laughs> Classic <laughs> Welcome to DubSpot. We believe in providing you hands-on experience right away. Whether you're completely new to music and want to turn the sounds in your head into a musical reality, 
or you're an experienced artist looking to refine your skills and add new tools to your arsenal, we're ready to meet you at your level. For students of all ages, all levels, and all styles of music, DubSpot is here to help you achieve your goals. With course offerings both online wherever you are and at our school in the heart of New York City, we are ready to guide you through the next phase of your musical transformation. Whether you want to produce music, DJ, or do both, you've come to the right place. Come explore DubSpot for yourself. Become a part of our community and make music.